Hey, what's up everyone? Today we are going to walk through sound design and uh, how I put together this trailer for my short film. Well, I think the real problem is returning to the society. Think things will be easier? And as you know, society is not ours, and the countries you've just mentioned are all at war. Wait, that is And when was I supposed to tell you, Derek? Removing the existence of these ideologies will essentially eliminate the man-made caste system. Do you know what it's like to watch the person you love be happy with someone else? We have a chance to save ourselves, to save our humanity from itself, to reprogram ourselves to be more effective members of society. So sound design is something that I'm kind of just working on, just trying to get better at um, by using some of the tools that I have. As you know, visuals uh, are great, but they can be enhanced by having some really, really good audio. So you want to make sure you have layers. So you want to have atmospheres, you want to have risers, and you want to have hits, wishes, and things that enhance uh, the what's happening on the screen. You're creating a location. And what does that location sound like? Um, so the first thing you want to start off with is the, that basically room tone or atmosphere of what it sounds like. And I wanted this to sound a little bit dark. Um, so that undertone of darkness is there. Um, and then we also use the outer limits, which is a, another sound. I'll let you hear that separately. Very low, very tony sound. And that's really all it is, just one one tick and so what i decided to do is drop that down and cut this into um, a smaller clip so that i could time it like i wanted to and now i can copy these two and then i'm gonna copy these four and then i'm gonna copy these eight and now we're we're building out that sound But what I did was from here, um, I made sure that I took some time to figure out like what parts of the film that I want to have in this trailer. So a hit and a riser is basically the same thing, just reversed. So when you have a hit, it's a big boom and then it kind of fades down. A riser is nothing but a fade up to a hit. And it's just the reverse of each other. So, and you want even these clips to kind of change. And I don't think I did this yet, but the clips need to change. You want them to change with the ticks here. So that was a little bit off, right? So we want that to actually change with that you know and even this one should change with this so I'm lining up these cuts with the sound at this point when I step away and I hear and I come back and I hear it I feel like that it's not full enough there's there's more things that we can add to it to make it a little bit more fuller so what we did um, next was we decided to add in um, some some more sounds to enhance that rise and fall. And I wanted to add uh, something that felt a little bit more sci-fi. And that's where we came to the sound of this Odyssey, which is kind of like a um, it's kind of like a vibrating sound or a res resonating sound uh, that just feel sci-fi um, and here's what it sounds like and it just I was like I love that right but the problem with that sound is that it had it had a um, it had a, a, a kind of pace to it already and we've already created our pace in the in our film, right? So the problem is that we can't really use that. So what I had to do was cut that up 
to sound like I wanted it to sound. So here's what we here's what we ended up creating, and I'm going to show you how to create this. So we we made two different sounds there um, from the same sound. So what I did was I came in and I pulled this down and sometimes I pick an area to just play with. Yeah. So So what I decided to do was cut this up and place this in front of that. And now we have our own sound from that effect. So if you think about just this one section, we have one, two, three, four layers of elements um, including, I mean, if we also include the um, the undertone and the atmosphere that brings it in. And every time we hit, we want to bring this sound in again, which gives it, it just gives it that little bit more element sound. And like... that made sense for the element of the film. So we have the ticking, we have the sci-fi. One more element of this film was civil unrest. I wanted to add in that element very slightly. I took this and I found a good sounding USA. I think it was right there. I think it was that one right there. Yeah. So I cut it up and then I right clicked and I uh, detached the audio, right? So now I have the audio of USA. So it's a little bit too fast. <laughs> if you hear it, it's like, I need to be, I need to be more like USA. USA, right? So what I wanted to do was um, go in here and retime this. So I'm gonna retime this, I'm gonna slow it down. And I played with this a little bit, um, but in the sake of time, I ended up with 72%, I believe. Um, and now you can see like the start of this USA, which is right here in this waveform. Um, and the second USA is right at the tick point right here. So it lines up pretty well. Now let's hear it. So now we have that sound and I feel like it gives this this little bit of an element. It's slow if you know so I love it right but I don't want it to be as noticeable. So, and then we have the ability to bring the underwater effect in and just drop that underneath there. And now this brings that sound down. So now it sounds like an undertone, right? When we add those three elements together, the hit that we had, or the hit, reverse hit to riser that we had, um, which adds that kind of sound to it. It combines to be a really strong hit, uh, which I love. Well, I think the real problem is returning to the society. I think things will be easier. And as you know, societies like ours and the countries you've just mentioned are all at war. Wait, that is And when was I supposed to tell you, Derek? Removing the existence of these ideologies will essentially eliminate the man-made caste system. Do you know what it's like to watch the person you love be happy with someone else? We have a chance to save ourselves, to save our humanity from itself, to reprogram ourselves to be more effective members of society. So we 
created this entire thing from scratch just now. I know this was a longer video, but <laughs> I wanted to show you step by step how I created that. Um, hopefully that's helpful to you, uh, showing you how I did that. Um, a lot of this is going to come from you just being creative and sitting down with it and trying to figure out what you want to create from it. Um, I learned this just by playing around with the sounds and like I would hear other people making these type of uh, videos, but I didn't know how they were doing it until I just sat down and played with the sounds and tried to layer the sounds like, like as I heard them. Um, so that's how to, to do it um, and make something from scratch. It may be a little bit tedious. It may take some time. Um, and it may be easier to use sound that's already created, but I feel like it's more rewarding um, in this way because you have something that's very unique. So let me know um, if you guys have any questions. You can find more videos like this in longer form with more in-depth uh, information on our Patreon. Um, you can join that community today by clicking in the link below. But we really appreciate you being a part of the community. And uh, let me know in the comments below if you have any questions. And I will I'll let you in the next video. Peace.